welcome back to my channel, Love Tappy. My name is Kaylin, and today we're talking about more baby names because, yes, you guys, I am only like six weeks postpartum. I just had a baby. No, I'm not pregnant again. But I have done some baby name videos that have got some great feedback. And the last video I did was my top 20 baby girl names with really great meanings that I love. It actually chose my daughter's name from that list. So I was not holding out on you guys at all. But since I was pregnant with a girl, I did all girl names. And I just feel like so incomplete not doing the boy names. On my phone before I knew it was a girl I have so many boy names so I just want to make this video and share with you my top 20 boy names I'm curious to see if we ever do get pregnant with a boy if our son's name will be on this list because I just love all these names these baby boy names are a mix of classic and unique they're not too far out there and they all have great meanings because my husband and I think the meaning of a name is important if you're watching this video because you are pregnant or a mama I make lots of videos for people like you so I'd love to have you stick around by subscribing okay guys let's jump into the names the first one is is so cute and that is Bennett and that means blessed and that is just the perfect meaning and such a cute name I think the nickname Ben or Benny is super cute for a boy when I think of the name Ben I think of a man who is quiet but strong and I like that name my next name I have loved for years and that is Harvey I just think Harvey is the cutest name and Harvey means strong or battle worthy which is a great strong name for a man the next name I really like I heard from youtuber here on YouTube obviously and her name is Elle Linquish. she has a vlog channel on a personal channel but that name is Ford and I just think Ford is such a cool name it's strong it's simple straight to the point and a Ford is a river crossing so it's not like a super obviously positive meaning for a name but I think you can kind of read into that and kind of play on some symbolism in the meaning of that name like someone who can cross over challenges in their life or things like that so I just like that name Ford okay next up is a biblical name that you've heard before and that is Luke and Luke is just one of my favorite names I could totally see us naming our son Luke I just think it's so cute and strong and Luke means light giving which I think is a really interesting and positive meaning for a name and even though it's popular I just have such a draw towards that name I could totally see us using that in the future for our son okay the next one is one other one that is a little bit more common that I heard growing up but I haven't heard a lot these days because you know how names obviously go in trend and I feel like I have not heard this one recently at all and that is Jason and I just think that is such a cute but strong name and that means healer which I think would be a beautiful meaning for a man to have just someone who would bring healing because that's what Jesus did here on this earth so I think that would be an awesome name this next name came up when my husband and I were pregnant well I was pregnant but you know how they say it with my first daughter so before we found out her gender and that is Reese we just think it sounds kind of cool and different and that means ardent or fiery so if you want to have a fiery strong son then you should name him Reese my next favorite baby boy name is Ethan I love the name Ethan because it sounds really cool and it sounds all these names sound strong but I think we want like our sons to be strong so it makes sense that these are strong names and in fact Ethan does mean strong it means firm strong and long-lived which are all obviously incredible meanings for your son the next name that I think is a really cool name I'm more so like the nickname but the nickname would be Nico and that could be short for Nicodemus but I don't know Nicodemus is kind of a mouthful <laughs> that's a biblical name and Nicodemus was a Pharisee and the leader of the Jews but I think the name Nico is so so cute so I think I'd probably just go for Nico and that means victory of the people which I love and speaking of victory for the people the next name is victory I just have this draw towards names that are words like for instance our second daughter's name is Haven and it totally sounds like a name but it also means a safe place or a refuge I think there's something really cool about just like going for it and naming your kid like a word that people know so I think victory is pretty much the most awesome just one word name you could give your son because who doesn't want to lead like a victorious life you know what I mean here's another name that is a little bit different but yet sounds totally normal it's just not one that you hear every day and that is Brennan and Brennan is actually Irish for Prince the next name I recently heard someone I follow on Instagram I can't even remember who it is but I think her son is named this and that is Curran and I just think that's such a neat name it's spelled C-U-R-R-A-N I guess you could spell it E-N but online when you look up the name it comes up as A-N even though I kind of like the E-N better but Kern is Gaelic for hero, and that's a cool name. But Kern, I don't know, Kern sounds very current, you know? Maybe it's too trendy, too current. Maybe it's not going to last in time. But I just thought that was a neat name, and I wanted to include it because I thought it was different, and I liked it. Okay, the next name, I don't think... Now that I think of it, I don't think I'd actually name our son this, but I do like it, so I just wanted to include it, and that is the name Merit. This is kind of similar to the idea of victory because Merit has 
you know, a practical meaning, which means to earn or deserve. The name Merit is also Egyptian for beloved. This name doesn't totally click with me, but I wanted to throw it out there for you because I haven't heard it really, so I just thought someone out there might like that name. The next name I think is adorable, and that is Miles. I don't know why I think that's such a cute name. I guess it kind of sounds like a nickname almost, but it just has this sweet kind of sense to it and Miles means soldier. I love this next name. I mentioned this previously in a baby names video, but I had to include it because it's still a boy name that I love. And we actually have friends who have an older son who's probably like 15 named this. And that is Jed, which could be short for Jedediah, but I just like the name Jed. I just think it sounds so cool. It kind of sounds like Jet. I think Jet would be a cute name too. But more than anything, I love the meaning of the name. It's Hebrew and it means beloved of the Lord or friends of the Lord. I really, really like that name. I totally could see us using that name for our son. Like really could see us using that name. Next up, I have a few friends who have this name for their son, but I just wanted to include it. I'm not going to use it because literally one of my closest friends' son is named this, but that name is Ezra, and this name has definitely been gaining traction and popularity, but I think it's so cute and different, and it's easy to say, and what it means is little helper, and I don't know what mom wouldn't want to name their kid little helper because I don't know what mom doesn't want a child to be their little helper. Next up is Barrett, and Barrett means to bear power, bear strength, and I like this name because it is different but it also is totally just like a normal sounding name and I think the nickname bear is just the cutest nickname. Next we have a name that is popular for girls now and I like this name before I realized it was getting popular for girls. I still like it and that is the name Emerson. I am kind of turned off naming our son Emerson. Our son I'm saying our son like I'm pregnant with our son but our future son if God gives us a son I'm kind of turned off from naming our future possible son Emerson because it is becoming more popular as a girl name but I think that name is so cute and different and it just sounds very American to me and Emerson means brave and powerful okay my next name I kind of came up with or at least I haven't really heard of it, it was one that just popped into my head a year or two ago and that is the name Everest which you know Mount Everest is the highest mountain in the world it isn't really used as a traditional name like it doesn't have a history as a person's name but I think that it's cool that it's the highest mountain in the world and the other reason I like this name is kind of different and that's because God calls us to live in a place of rest and I like that the name is ever rest so it's like we can forever be in a place of rest tell me that's not cool I'm a little bit weird for thinking of something like that but that really drew me to the name and I swear we would name our son this if we weren't short people because my husband and I just are smaller people and I think our son might get made fun of if his name was Everest and he was short what do you think about that it still could work. He could still pull it off, totally. But I just like that name and I like kind of the meaning I extracted from that name. Okay, we have two more. The next one is Boaz. We have a friend who named their son Boaz. And some people think it's different, but I just think it's the cutest name. If you know the Bible, Boaz is pretty much like the most awesome guy besides Jesus in the Bible. He is a husband of Ruth. And if you haven't read the story of Ruth, it's such a short chapter. You have to read it. It's just the cutest love story ever. And you'll fall in love with Boaz like I have. And Boaz means swiftness or strength is within so it has a great meaning too. The next name on my list is Riker and I think Riker is so cute. It's different but it's also very straightforward and it's not like different confusing different like some names can be but Riker is Danish and it means superior strength. So guys those are my top 20 favorite boy names. Again besides a few random ones these are some of my all-time favorite boy names and I hope that we get pregnant with a boy one day so that we can use one or maybe more of these names depending on what God's plans are for us with kids in the future. But I hope that you enjoyed this. Let me know down in the comments your favorite name on this list that we should use if we get pregnant with a boy in this future because I promise you, I 100% promise you, if we do, I'm gonna come back and look at this video and look at the comments. Again, if you're new to my channel, I'd love to have you subscribe, especially if you're gonna be a new mom because I myself am a mama and I make videos for mamas like you as well. I love you and I hope that you have a beautiful day because you're absolutely worth it. And congratulations if you're pregnant. I will see you in the next video. Bye. Love.